Yo guys, what is up? Uh, finally hit it. Uh, hit it a couple days ago, actually. Um, but this is, I decided to wait till now because this is going to be the final video. Um, just showcasing my Xbox 360 gamer score and uh, how I how I did it and the games I play. As you can see, I played 365 games, which is a ridiculous amount. Um, I want to give a huge shout out to um, one of my really good friends who uh, started this whole, who got me into gamer score and whatnot. Uh, where is he? Uh, Master Straw. Just want to give him a huge shout out. Uh, um, I'm gonna link him in the video. Um, link him to the video. So he's got 46,000 gamer score. I remember back when he had 18. I had. Uh, that's when I really started. That's when I passed him up. Uh, never looked back. Uh, another friend I want to give a quick shout out to. Actually, there's two more for uh, just getting me involved with gamer score and whatnot. Another one is Noam's of Fury. He's got 78,000 essentially. Um, just a huge shout out to him. He's he was one of the people that uh, I just enjoyed getting achievements with or talking about achievements with or whatnot. Um, and then finally, where is he? Um, I'm a junkie. Uh, he's another one that uh, Master Shaw and I uh, play with, and we got zombie achievements and stuff like that. Uh, but let's go through this. I've completed 12 games, got all of 1,000. Uh, Minecraft, MW2, World at War, COD 4, Harm's Way, TMNT, Backyard Football 10, Halo 3 ODSD, Dash of Destruction, NBA 2K6, Avatar, and Madden 06. Um, so we'll just go through here. I'll point out some notable games. Uh, NCAA and XCOM I'm not complete with yet. Um, I can get all but this achievement right here. <coughs> uh, sorry, I tatered. A little sick. Um, but I can get all but that, so I'll have 900 gamers score for this. Uh, didn't really get any ghost achievements, really. I didn't play the campaign all that much. Um, missing two achievements for 25. Um, game was that? Smell Yourself Blacklist. I just bought that and then I returned it, really, because I didn't like it. Um, oh, I maxed out Walking Dead, pretty much. I didn't buy the other add-on, uh, but essentially maxed that out. Resident Evil 5, I could have maxed out. I just didn't beat it on Professional, and I just decided not to get a couple other achievements. Um... Oh, this is really hard to read when you... I'm missing two achievements in Black Ops, all the intel, and one achievement that's stupid. Uh, it's like glitched on my Xbox. The Destroy All Targets, the Lord Nelson, it's like glitched on my Xbox, so I can't get it. Uh, I tried for like hours to get that. Um, Bioshock, great game. Bioshock Infinite, uh, I do have 1,000. I did complete all the gamer score for the original. Uh, the add-on is awful, this one at least. I will be getting it. I'm going to buy it back probably um, and then get the new add-ons, the ones for uh, Reliving Rapture, and I'll get those achievements. Uh, Devil May Cry, that's a great game. I just didn't I just didn't finish it. I uh, got no achievements for Magic 2014 even though I own it. Uh, Remember Me, that's a really good game. Need for Speed Most Wanted. Oh, that's the new menu for Speed Most Wanted. There's World at War, Max that out, Yu-Gi-Oh! 5Ds. Uh, you'll see some of these where I flip through and there's like no gamer score because I got the games without really checking out the gamer score, which is stupid. Dead Island Riptide, I don't know why I didn't play that more. I love Dead Island, I love the original one. Uh, Gears of War Judgment, I still have like 30 games or whatnot of double XP, I don't know why I bought that. Uh, Deus Ex, I didn't really like Deus Ex, I know it's a good game, people love it, but I don't know, it just wasn't for me. There's the original Need for Speed Most Wanted. One of my achievements is glitched on it, and I don't know. It's just it's one of those games that's super repetitive, and I don't know. I failed at getting uh, the whatever it is bounty like three times, and it just frustrated me. I quit. A uh, Tomb Raider, great game. One of my favorites, actually. Uh, Dead Space Three, another one of my favorites. See here, two worlds, two of the worst games of all time. Um, uh, see here, Far Cry 3. I almost 1,000 this, almost <coughs> max maxed out, but I didn't complete the co-op maps. They're long, and I really didn't have any friends to play with, so it was just kind of a meh. Eh, I don't really feel like doing it. Wasn't worth it really. Uh, Crisis. Uh, that was one of the games. Uh, Gnomes of uh, Fury let me play while I was at his house. Darksiders 2, Left 4 Dead, Dead Space 1, American Nightmare, Spec Ops Line, 
This may be the fourth video that goes up today, just simply because I might try to upload those three NCA videos uh, too. So this may be a four video day. I don't know when the last time uh, that was. Combat Evolved Anniversary, that was a great game. Finest Fantasy, one of my favorite games of all time. Uh, somehow my like achievements got reset for both Final Fantasies. Final Fantasy 13 and Final Fantasy 13 2. I don't know, they got like reset or something like that. I don't know what happened. Uh, Dark Souls, another good game. I don't know what happened, why I didn't finish that game, but it's an awesome game. Dead Island, the original, love that. Uh, Fear 3, played that with uh, Master Straw. Played most of these with friends. Iron Brigade, played that with a bunch of friends. Uh, Duke Nukem Forever, loved that game. Red Dead Redemption, another good one. Homefront, really just played the online in that, which was awesome. Played that with another one of my good friends. Bioshock 2, loved that too. Dragon Age 2, loved that a lot, even though I didn't get that much gamers for. Uh, Castle Crasher is good, played that. Bullet Storm. Call of Duty 3 is hard. That campaign is hard. Uh, Vanquish, Medal of Honor, Fear, the original. You can see there's a lot of like 10 or 0 gamer scores. Fallout 3, my game actually got glitched on Mothership Zeta or whatever, so I can't even beat that game. Alan Wake, Sniper Ghost Warrior, my game is glitched in that too. There's a lot of games where I just am glitched, I can't do anything. Uh, Splinter Cell Conviction, played that with a friend. Army of Two, the 40th Day. King Kong, that's an easy game, I just didn't like it. TMNT, another easy game. EA Sports Fight Night Club, or that's a pretty decent one. Dante's Inferno, love this game, it's amazing. One of the best games, that, one of my favorites. It's in my top ten, probably. Uh, Lord of the Rings. Uh, just had to check my recording, make sure it wasn't lagging or anything. Um, Operation Force Dragon Rising, bad game. Uh, Rainbow Six Vegas, I like Rainbow Six Vegas too. Um, Commander's Challenge, Command and Conquer Red Alert 3, that's a great game. Uh, just liked it more on computer than the Xbox. Eat Lead, interesting game. Red Faction Guerrilla, another interesting good game. Armageddon was good. Prototype, one of my favorite games of all time, even though I didn't play it that much. Or beat it. Um, on this, I, I, played it, I played it on another friend's account and beat it. Uh, X-Men, Assassin's Creed 1, definitely the best Assassin's Creed. Uh, maybe not gameplay mechanics-wise, but story-wise and all that. Greatest, greatest Assassin's Creed. Fable 2, love that. Played the crap out of that. Um, let's see here. We're getting back. We're getting back in the day. Uh, Ghostbusters, played that with a friend. Uh, Crackdown, I swear it's responsible for my color blindness, but it's really not. But that game is insane. It hurts my eyes to play. Uh, Soul Calibur 4, one of my favorite games I used to play on the PS2 was Soul Calibur 3, I think. Ninja Blade, NBA Live 06, which you can't complete a thousand because play an online game and the servers are down so you can't even play it. They took them down to Godfather, uh, Force Unleashed, Oblivion, uh, which I actually played Oblivion recently. I don't know why it's all the way back here. Uh, Circle of Doom, the last, the, <laughs> the game, it's not the one of the first games. One of the first games I played was like Gears 2 or Call of Duty 4, uh, but Kingdom Under Fire, Circle of Doom, I kind of enjoyed it. Didn't get any gamer score for it, but the last time I played it, it was offline. First time a game is registered to be last played as the longest last play is uh, The Force Unleashed from March 24th of 2009. Uh, just, I'll start a party. We can take one final look. This is my Xbox 360 um, final kind of view here. Um, yeah, that's my motto and whatnot. Underground Zone, using the Nade Shot Gamer Picture Pack, even though Nade Shot's not even like in my top like 10 of favorite play. Yeah, it's maybe top 10. Uh, but I've been on Xbox for four years. Technically, I've had my Xbox for like six or seven. Um, actually, I've been online for five. I had another account <coughs> that I signed up, and then it kind of just tanked, and I don't know. I don't know where that went. Uh, so, I don't know. I've been on Xbox Live for five. I think I've had my Xbox for seven. Um, so, yeah, that's going to do it. Uh, 365 games played. Just ridiculous. Um, and, uh, like, I max prestiged every Call of Duty, um, working on Ghosts now, but that won't get completed on 360, probably will get completed on the 1. Um, so, yeah, I've spent countless hours playing Call of Duty, Madden Ultimate Team, um, getting gamer score, uh, but I got about, 
not quite 33%. I got about, I would say about 30, 29%, 28% of all achievements and gamer score. So, yeah, uh, just big shout outs to those guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't. Let me know how you guys did on the Xbox 360 with gamer score if you didn't care, or with Call of Duty or whatever, um, like your crowning achievements for Xbox 360, I guess. But I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.